Hey, welcome to another episode of On the Peg. Today on the Peg, we're looking at DC Moldyrus Robin Tim Drake, the gold label edition. So let's take him out of the package, take a look, and talk about him. to another episode of On The Peg. No, not doing movie toys this today. No, no, no more movie toys this week at all. Today we're looking at the gold label Tim Drake Robin. And I actually am happy I got this guy. Um, you know, a couple things I, I want to make note of. Okay. Uh, I like the fact he comes with accessories for change. They actually have accessories that make sense. Now, I will have to say one thing. The body size, I put him next to uh, a regular Batman. He's big for sidekick. He's big. <laughs> so I'm assuming this is Tim Drake, Robin, as in a, like a young adult in his 20s. So he's big and he's buff. But I really do like the sculpt. The cape detail is nice. You know, the whole chest piece is well done. It actually looks like a really good character. It's a good figure. You can see the R clearly. This one I do recommend if you see him, pick him up. The only other issue I did have, a minor issue, what happens with a lot of the multiverse toys, the accessories don't always fit in the hands properly. You almost have to stretch the hands out a little bit. And, uh, you know, hey, if you're a 3D guy, seriously, this would be a perfect time to make a round base, nice and thick with two pegs, that have the Robin R on it. I can only, I could dream of having... Decent bases. Let's stream. Decent bases. Social life. <laughs> Not. I don't think either one's gonna happen anytime soon. I'll probably get bases before I get a social life. Yeah, yeah. Facing reality. But, but like I said, I have my toys. I have you, my loyal few, and we'll see you on the next. Yeah, yeah.